Hey guys, it's Falcon. This is Retail Tycoon 2. I just started this uh, this store. I actually have another bigger store, but um, I started this one not too long ago. Um, the first thing I did is I got a uh, got a cashier and a cash register, two shelves, and I filled them up with toys and soda. And you might be thinking, well, why do you do toys and soda? Why did you pick that, Falcon? Well, here's why. I went through each of these, and I found out that, see this, you make a little bit more than double the money from it. This one, you don't make double from it. So I went through all of these, and I found out which ones are the most profitable. And the ones that I found that are the most profitable are toys, beverages, and game tables and they all make you about a hundred and twenty five percent profit that's a little more than doubling how much money you make on each one of them so that's what I decided to focus on because I thought well maybe that'll be the most profitable and by doing that I can um, get myself further ahead faster so um, a little while into it, I bought another shelf, and I put more toys on it, I'm going to get another one and put more toys on it, but I put some baskets over here, because, uh, the guys wanted to carry more. Oh, and I, I got a second, I got a second parking spot to start out that way. That way it would be, golly, these guys are littering all over my place. Let's clean up the trash. So it looks like, yeah, we're good there. But, uh, yeah, so basically I'm just trying to maximize the money that I get back for the money I spend. I spent 400 on those. Oh, and then I, shortly after that, I got a truck driver. Once I had enough money to hire him. That way, I don't have to worry about going to the store and do all that. Um, so right now, my focus is just keeping the keeping the shelves full. So that these guys can keep spending their money here. Ooh, look, my money just goes up so quick this way. Um, I'd like to get two thousand to get another parking space, also, but I think I'm going to go for the toy shelf. last kind of toy there. Boom. Rockets. There we go. Alright, I've got all three different kinds of toy toys now. Yeah, I'm going to save up and get another parking space because I think that's going to be the best thing. See, these guys are looking for some toy cars, toy rockets. See, it's a good thing I put the toy rockets there. I now made uh, 25 times 5, 125 money off that guy. Just because I had the rockets. Oh, hopefully a whole bunch of people get out of this car. Oh, yes. They got kids and everything. So, two toys, one soda, two sodas. Two sodas. Ooh, five toys. Yeah, we're going to get a whole bunch of money from them. This is great. Um, let's see if we need to... We still got a whole bunch of weight for loading dock, so... We should be good for at least one more trip. I think the pickup truck holds... Yeah, it holds 300, so as long as we got enough for him to go for another full load, I don't feel too compelled to, uh, to do that. Alright, 
Let's make sure these shelves are nice and full. Oh, so something cool that I found out yesterday when I was doing this. If you go to stats, you look here and you see these things. 8,000, when you get there, you get this item called a money tree. It makes your stuff 2% more profitable. So you can get a whole bunch of money trees for each of these. And they also help make your environment your decoration a little bit better too. So money trees are super cool. All right, I'm going to put you guys on pause for a little bit. I'm just going to keep doing the same thing. And I'll, but the next thing I'm going to do is get 2,000 and buy a parking spot here. I might even get 3,000 after that and buy a parking spot. That way I have four. We'll see how it's looking at that point. And uh, if it's looking good, this trash is full. At that point, we might hire another cashier and a janitor and a restocker or something. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But for right now, I'm going to just work on maximizing what I have. Now, that guy, he probably picked up stuff. Yes, yeah, I've only got four there. I want to make sure he's got enough to go pick up. So... Toys are in more dire need than my. I get 20 toys, 20 more toys, 50 beverages, and that's almost two more truckloads ready to go. Alright, I'm, I'm pausing you guys for real. I'll be back. I'm just basically going to do the same thing. I'm going to order more stuff, sell it two more parking spaces and then I'll come back and update you with my next plan. Alright guys, I didn't make it to the next parking space. Alright guys, I got my third uh, parking spot here, but I didn't get to the fourth one before I uh, hired a guard and a janitor. Well, it's basically so I didn't have to worry about emptying out the garbage can and arresting the robbers whenever they came in. Um, as you can see, I, my truck is still out. It's got a lot of stuff it can pick up. Um, so I'm doing pretty good on inventory. So next I'm going to go ahead and get that fourth parking spot. So let me get it queued up here. Do, do, do. Boom. Oh. Oh, because I got to put concrete there. So I need 640 more. As you can see with three parking spaces, um, here we'll go in here real quick, and as you can see with three parking spaces, and this stuff, I've pretty much got my cashier busy all the time, um, which is good, because that means I can sell lots of product. Um, so as soon as I get another little bit of money here, about another 500 more, I should be able to. Uh, they gotta buy seven items. This guy's buying four. Look at this. These guys are just waiting in line to cash out. We need some cars with fewer people in them. Got two big cars. All right, let's get the. Um, let's get this parking spot going. Boom. There we go. That ought to keep my cashier super busy. 
Um, yep. Because he'll have four cars to deal with. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and let this get built back up. I'm going to have to build my inventory back up. So that... Uh, Yeah, I'm just going to have to build my inventory back up so that I can, because uh, I just spent almost $4,000. Uh, I'm going to run over here real quick and add truck cost. So uh, this thing right here. Just about because we got plenty of them. Let's get some new toys run out of inventory to stock for the stalker that would be a bad idea um, all right so a little pickup truck is five thousand I think it's 25 accelerates at 60 cargo van is seven thousand five hundred and carries twice as much so I should get a cargo van I should save for a cargo van because right now I'm having Full. Ooh, a sprinter van's even better. Ooh, we should save up ten thousand for that. Yeah, we should save up ten thousand for the uh, sprinter van. Because right now, I'm having trouble keeping my storage. Just my one driver, so. That's good. That means my store is hopping fast. Oh, this should still be full. Yes, I'm sorry. That's kind of cool. All right, so um, I'm going to save up some money, um, and I'll come back to you guys in just a second and see what I decide to spend it on after I've had a little bit of time to think about it. Gosh, look at this time. We could get people in and out faster. We could uh, actually make more money. So it might be. Check out what my store is. Uh, Two thousand self checkout is ninety five. Small shop impulse buy. Yeah, I might get a self-checkout thing here in a little bit just to help get these faster and make it so I don't have to spend money on the cashiers. Um, all right, I'll be right back. I'll let you know what I'm going to do, but I'm probably going to get a I'll probably get a cash register and then save up some more money and then I'll come back to you guys. All right, guys, I'm back. As you can see, I haven't really done anything. I did hop in the truck and drive inventory back and forth because my little worker is having keeping up so I had to fill it up and give him the truck back. Um, so I think what I'm going to build is an automatic checkout stand to help with this line that never ends. And that'll cycle cars in and out faster and get me money a little bit quicker. Which should help I think with uh, making money faster and truck driving for my little guy pretty awful, but my next upgrade, I'm saving up 10000 to get a much bigger delivery truck. It carries three times as much as the current delivery truck he's using, so it'll... Oh, actually, um, I did want to get a dumpster. We'll stick it back here for my janitor, and a little bit of shelving so that I can hold some more inventory. Um... I'm not really sure how much that expanded. It was at a thousand, so that gives it an extra five hundred. Um, so we'll get we'll get two of those, and then we'll save up for the for the upgraded vehicle. There we go.
Alright, now I got to save up. I'll be back with y'all shortly. Alright, my truck driver's having trouble keeping up again, so here's a, here's a little trick. If you get this particular spawn spot, you can have the shortest delivery truck drive. So it takes two minutes for the computer to do a trip. Um, if you're looking at the timer, it takes me about 30 seconds, I think. Um, so that means I can drive it four times as fast as the driver if I if I do it manually. But storage. I can go back to letting my driver do it himself. Um, I like to let him do it. It's, it's a little bit tedious driving around when you could just be, you know, hanging out and managing your shop. But that's okay. That's the way it is. Then when I come back, we'll be buying something. Probably an upgraded truck is what I'm going to go for. I don't know. Um, yep. So I'll be back in just a minute. All right, guys. As you can see, there's a long line at my store. I haven't driven the truck since since you all saw me do it. So the guy was able to maintain it about halfway. I have been like reordering stuff. 
got a little bit of stuff and supplies, but now I've got 10,000. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go buy the upgraded $10,000 vehicle. Um, this I'm pretty excited about because I think this will help a lot with the management. I think next, I'm probably going to save up for a manager and a manager's desk. The desk is 3000 Oh yeah, so um, right now is the Christmas event, so around the map you'll see all sorts of little uh, packages and stuff. If you get a hundred of them, I think, it unlocks a Christmas tree and a snowman and stuff that you can put down. The Christmas tree is a pretty good uh, decoration, and it helps you uh, helps you keep your decoration looking good. I used to some of the bigger map, which may about, I want to say it's 1,500 tree. That's about it, so. Alright, we're gonna stick this truck over here. Oops. There we go. Get out of that. Um, Alright, I'm gonna pause it again. When I get a manager or something, I'll come back to you. Alright, guys, I'm back. Um, I accidentally purchased a manager's desk. Um, there's two different ones. You'll have to, uh, so there's. This one is 3,000, and it's like the big one. And there's this one that's the finance rep desk. Or any employee. So, you can use this for any employee. Um, finance reps have to use this one. And managers, if you get a big one, it kind of looks cool. So, um, yeah. So, I'm going to hire my manager. Boom. And we're going to set him to stock us up to 200% on everything. And he should start auto-purchasing stuff for us. Um, to make sure that the truck gets us up to whatever it is we need to get up to. Um, so that's good. Um, we can kind of auto-make our money now. Um, the other thing I'm going to do is... Some shelving. If you remember at the beginning of this video, I said that the, the one bot, the, the place systems or whatever, were, uh, were the other profitable things. So I'm actually going to put those in. Oh, we need a fourth one. We need money. Um, bring it up. We need the 250. Come on. Hopefully my man. Come on, come on, just to 250. Thirty. Forty. Oh, the manager bought stuff, I think. Dang. Come on, come on, come on. We just need a little bit more. 
There we go. All right, so we got that set up, and we're gonna stock it real quick. Oops, go ahead and stock it with. Where is it? There it is. One by two game tables. So pool table, air hockey, ping pong, and some foosball. All right. Now those are the next profitable things also. Um, so the manager will start stocking those up. Um, they cost, uh, I think they cost 150 each. Yeah, they cost 155 each. So he'll start buying those and stocking those up. And then our stock employee will fill it up and we'll keep making money. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. Um, I'm going to keep earning money, and I'm going to start the next video. So like and subscribe, comment below. Uh, most of all, have a great day, and I'll post the next video tomorrow.